I'm here with Nez Arog. She's a local talent, an artist, a singer, songwriter, and she's a coach for transformational radical change. Nez, tell us a little bit about what inspired you to get into singing, songwriting, and the radical changes and tr transformations that you're working on. Thanks, Pass. Well, what inspired me was, I guess, losing my voice from a very young age, not literally, but emotionally, feeling like um, I wasn't worthy enough to share my message and couldn't really be myself. So I decided that I would turn that around and share what I have to share. This song was based on my childhood, um, about my childhood wounds and healing that. So it came from a very raw and a very real place. And um, it was very difficult to share at first, but I'm glad that I did so that I could inspire and create change for others. It's about finding that voice, your true self, one that may have been buried, yeah. Under the emotional turmoil of those yeah. life events. Under the not good enough, under the negative belief systems. Sometimes this can really take over and become our pattern, our major pattern in our whole life and actually act as a real sabotage. You particularly share a passion for um, domestic violence? Yes. Uh, well, I went through a lot of domestic violence in my life and um, emotional abuse, verbal abuse, well, physical abuse and um, not that it's limited to those, just those categories, but that's why it's a passion of mine because once it was a void where there was a lot of shame, couldn't really talk about it, was in a lot of judgment of myself uh, and felt like I was all alone and it only took me being real and owning it and sharing it that allowed me to change it, seek help, you know, uh, and uh, create new possibility in my life. And now I like to do that for others. That's brilliant. And isn't it a, an amazing thing in life when people go through the suffering themselves, find some solutions and then start to share it with others so that they can help them too? What would you share as some of the solutions for men and women out there that may be uh, victims of uh, domestic violence? Okay, so not to be in shame about it. It is not your fault. Nobody deserves to be treated like that. Um, instead of becoming, a, saying a victim, become a victor, rise to your occasion, share your truth uh, and seek help. Do the work, heal yourself because you are beautiful no matter what is going on around you. You know, you are amazing no matter what is going on around you and don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Great, and You Are Beautiful is a very good reminder of, is that the song title? Yeah, no, the song's called Beautiful, yeah. And the, and the song's actually been an inspiration for me to do the work that I do outside of the song and outside of the music is my coaching and my counselling. So I'm very passionate about creating change for others, only because I've been through such darkness that I would like others to also transcend that, go through their hero's journey and rise to their occasion. Sure, and often you do find that the best therapists are the ones that have been through those circumstances and come out of them. I wouldn't say I'm the best therapist, but I'm always striving to be better and I have to say that I do have a lot of compassion and empathy and understanding and resonance because I have been through, yeah, a lot. Well, your song is featured, I think, on global charts. It was You were interviewed on CNN. Tell us a bit about that for a local Perth yeah, girl. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's great. Um, yeah, it won 14 international awards for it. Uh, and I was interviewed on CNN and a number of other networks. But it's, it's because the song was bigger than me. It was never really about me. Uh, so it was about spreading a message. So I don't like to really take full credit for it. It's, I think the song has a message and a vibration of its own. It's definitely a beautiful song. I've heard it and it lives to its title. Thank you. So thank you so much and thank you for the message today, for sharing that with our viewers. And is, is there a way people can look up your song or your details? Um, well, if you just Google Nez Iraq, um, so it's, uh, my counselling is Zen Life Counselling um, and the music would be under Nez Iraq on YouTube or you could find it on Spotify. Wonderful. Thank you so much for your time. No worries. Thank you. I'm Bas Tadros for Undercurrent.